This cheeseburger is for you, Mr. Jonas. Oh, do you mean this cheeseburger is for you, Mr. Lagoon? Oh boy. <laughs>
Good. She already dreamed about having a play date with Louise, but I don't want to wake Louise up either. And now, she's already dreaming about having a tea party at Bunham. I'll call the tea waiter about this. Hello? Hi, tea waiter. Hi, Max. Why did you call me for? I called you to tell you about Ruby's dream. Tell me what she dreamed about. She dreamed about having a tea party at your place. Wow. I never seen her having a dream about this. I really want you to talk to Lever about Ruby's dreams. Could you do that? Sure. Right now I gotta watch the Comedy Joe show. I will remind that by the way. Good night. Dream a good one, sis. Glad you made to the show, Mark. And what did you have in your hand? These are pink headphones. Punky give me these as a random gift. I can't believe that. Gone, Mark. Hello? Hi, leader. Oh, Max. Thank goodness it's you. I know, and I want to tell you something about Ruby. What is it? She had dreams. Wow, that's amazing. I really want Ruby to come to my palace to tell all about her dreams that she had last night. Could I do that for just in case when it's morning? Yes. Thanks. Have a good night. Oh yeah, yeah, you're finished now, Evil Red, you sleepy villain. Oh come on, don't tell me that she dreamed about defeating Evil Red. Oh come on, not my phone. What? You know what, Evil Red? I got to ask you a stern question. Did Ruby dreamed about defeating you? What? No, you fool. You know that she did not dream about that. Why does she's asleep? And yeah, she dreamed about that. Did not. Did too? And I'm gonna find you. I swear, I will find you. I am sure. Just wait and see until Ruby wakes up. Fine then, fool. And I'll destroy you then. I never care. You'd better stop. <sighs> hey, Ruby, are you up yet? Don't worry, Mr. Jonas. I've just woken up. Is this really a dreamland? It sure is. And boy, I'm glad you're awake. I know, and I felt more happy to be here. Anyway, is there a lot to do at this dreamland? If you don't mind, I saw you on Bunny Comedy TV. Yes, and this is why I want you to see something cool like I did in the Comedy Joe show. Oh, what is it? Come with me. Alright, here's the place that I was talking to you about. Wow, are you kidding me? I never seen an amusement park in my dreamland before, and what is that you did? I putted my hot dog on my cotton candy stick. Is this funny? I did that on the Comedy Joe show. Nice. How did you do that? I've gotten a hot dog, and I stick it on my cotton candy. When I put it on, I call it a cotton candy hot dog. Ha 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 ha. That's funny. I even made a dog flower balloon. How funny is that? Oh my goodness. This is the most funniest thing you ever did, Ruby. Ha 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 Hey! Stop that fool from dreaming! No way, Evil Red! She is dreaming right now! You are so gonna get the big bunny beat down for this! Wow, what great dreams that I had last night. I better go to Leader's Palace to tell him about this. I gotta get dressed. I heard about your dreams, Ruby. I know, that's why Max watched me sleep. Yes, and I can remember her dreams very well when she's asleep. You know what, Ruby? I had the same dream just like you did. And this is why I dreamed about having a play date with you. Can you believe that? That's great, Louise. Besides, Max have not made a signal noise in the house while I had that dream. I knew I was going to say that. I even know I did not tire this because of the comedy Joe show was hilarious. And when I called the tea waiter about Ruby's dream, 
Stay cool, guys! Thanks, Thanks Max. 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 Yeah, but pretty good if you're not a loser that much, Max. Oh, great! I knew I was not gonna ruin Ruby's dream like this. You are Sebastian Red Loser. Why did you crush Ruby's dreams? But, but I tried not to be evil. Uh, Don, I was jealous of Ruby dreaming about me getting busted by her. So, Jackie, what should you do with Evil Red? He tried not to crush my dreams, so what are you gonna do? Look, Ruby, I'm taking him to his house. My dad won't mind if he's here. Now, listen, Evil Red, you're coming with me right now. Man, this is great. Why did you drag me to your room? I said my dad won't mind. Anyway, I don't want to make you more stupid. Oh, come on. I don't want to. Wait, did you say more stupid? Wow, that's just what I always want Max and Drewby to be like. That's not what I was saying. I said to make you more stupid is wearing my fake hat. Oh, no. Oh, no is right. This is what you get for trying to ruin Ruby's dreams. Jackie, why is there a stranger in your room? I don't know, Dad. But his name is Evil Red. He learned his lesson how not to ruin Ruby's dreams. 